continues now with Ben Handelman, Stephanie Grady, and Tom Blocks. It is Inauguration Day here in Wisconsin today. Governor Tony Evers is sworn in for a second term. In his inaugural address, he lays out his vision for the state. He calls for Wisconsin to legalize marijuana and abortion. Says the state should expand badger care and invest more in local communities. He says voters decided those issue and more when they voted. Given the opportunity to retreat into division and doubt, Wisconsin chose a future of unity and faith. He basically spent most of his address today like it was a campaign rally, um, and I tried to spend most of my address focusing on where we could find common ground. Today, the Wisconsin legislature also started their new session. Republicans, they'll have a larger majority. They'll face off with the Democratic governor over the future of the state. And several bands, they were performing today during that inauguration ceremony. One of them was the Waukesha South Marching Band. The acoustics, right? Sounds great. The Waukesha South Marching Band also took part in the Christmas Parade. Students we spoke with say the Waukesha Parade tragedy has brought them closer together. I think uh, it's really pushed us to like, improve and uh, performances included the Milwaukee Children's Choir, Nina Community Band, Indian Community School, and the 132nd Army Band of the Wisconsin National Guard. And can I just say, I'm very happy it was inside for everyone's sake. At the, we have a beautiful capital.